Hello everybody, this is Brian Lathe and I have an exciting video about Spacebit. And Spacebit is a brand new game. In fact, it is so new that it's even in alpha phase right now. I believe there's only about 700 people playing this game. And it's going to be an exciting play-to-earn crypto game with NFTs and all kinds of fancy new technology. So uh, I invite you to check it out. It kind of reminds me of Master of Orion from the mid-90s or so. So I don't know if you're familiar with strategy games like uh, like Civilization and then, um, you know, the space, space version of Civilization was Master of Orion. And this kind of reminds me of Master of Orion. So you got a planet and you got some buildings, okay? So on your, uh, on your planet, you have buildings like metal mines, plastic refineries, glass factories, crystal mines, and these basically build your resources. And then you want to improve your warehouse, you want to improve your laboratory, you want to improve your hangar, and you want to improve your headquarters. So um, these are some basic buildings that um, right now are available on the planet. I'm sure eventually they'll probably have more buildings, but these are the what's available right now. And then you have the laboratory, which is basically your research facility. And you have different technologies that you can um, improve upon. And then you have your hangar, which is where you build your ships and store your ships. And then you have headquarters, which you can build your defenses. And um, planetary defenses are coming soon. Also on the headquarters, in, in, in addition to building your defense, you can also structure your settlers into builders, workers, and scientists. And um, you can also allocate whether you're going to uh, put more effort into different resources here. So as you can see, I'm got, I'm right now I have a lot of metal. And if I don't find a use for all this metal, I'm definitely going to want to back off this metal and then improve, you know, probably my crystal because I don't have as much crystal. So uh, that's that. I believe what is what this is allowing you to do here. Um, so I'm going to jump into the laboratory because I want to show you something. Actually, nope, nope, sorry. I want to jump into the hangar because one of the things I want to do right now in this game is I want to start building these heavy fighters because here I'll show you what I'm doing. I am realizing that these light fighters only have 64 storage and they're uh, 2794 as far as speed. I'm going to go back into the hangar now and then look at the heavy fighter. And they have 254 storage. They're a little bit slower. Okay. And uh, the, the range on the light fighter is four and the range on the heavy fighter is three. So I'm, I'm sacrificing a little bit of range and a little bit of speed to be able to carry a lot more. And I'm going to test that out. Now I have some prerequisites I got to do. Now I've, in the ones in green here, I've already satisfied. But I gotta increase my alloy mastery techn technology level to two, and I gotta increase my nanotech to level three. So that's done in the laboratory. So that here's the nanotech, and here is the alloy, mas alloy mastery. So I've already have enough resources to go ahead and upgrade that, and that'll take 20 minutes. So I'm gonna go ahead and click that. Now this is starting a countdown timer that'll improve that technology within 20 minutes and then I need to have some more glass and some more crystal to be able to upgrade this technology to the next level that one's going to take 43 minutes so I got a little bit of t uh, time I've got to invest on that but I just want to let you know I'm pretty excited about that when I have those two technologies upgraded I will then be able to start building this heavy fighter because I have all the rest of the uh, prerequisites done. Now, if you go up the next one to the light cruiser, I got to work really hard. I got to advance a lot of stuff. And then the heavy cruiser, I got to advance a lot of stuff. Bomber, I got to advance everything. Um, speeder, I got to advance a lot of stuff. Now, the speeder is really fast and doesn't have very much storage. So, um, I have a reason <laughs> that I need some storage. And I'm going to keep that kind of a secret right now. Because I've actually found something that I don't think too many people in this game have found. But I need a way where I, my ships have a lot of storage. 
so I can go gather something from somewhere where there's a stockpile of something that I'm trying to gather. That's what I'm working on right now. So I've only been playing this game a day, okay? But they've got a ranking system. I've got 137 points on this ranking system, and I'm 518th. I've, I believe I've done pretty well here. So I'm going to go here on the 518 spot and show you. So what it does is if your tied score, it it tells you the the best ranking for that position. I'm actually 518th because I probably hit that score of 137 after this guy. But uh, when I upgrade that technology in 20 minutes, I'm going to get some points for that. And I'm going to keep going up. And then, of course, I'm going to go out there and I'm going to get me more of that glass. And I'm going to get me more of this crystal in, in addition to what I'm producing on my, my by myself. Um, I'm going to get my get me some more and I'm going to get that other technology advanced and then I'm going to be much higher up the rankings. So I think this is a pretty exciting game. The way you get into this game is I want you to find my referral link to Crypto Mining Game, which I, I will have in the uh, I will have in the um, what do you call it? The uh, the, the description just want to let you know that you can right now build alliances in crypto mining game. So I'd love for you to join this game as well and join my alliance. I'm just going to bring up some scores here. And uh, right now I'm 136th place. There's a lot more people playing this game. Okay. To be in the top 100, you need 158,820 points. And there are nine days, I'm sorry, 14 days left in this season. I only have 136, 599, but I'm doing quite well. Okay, I am in this one right here, United Crypto Organization. So this is the alliance. This is the, uh, they call it a VMP, Virtual Mining Pool, I believe is what that stands for. But it's basically an alliance within the game. So go ahead and join this one. And then... Um, we only have 19 active players. We can have 50, so we got a lot of room for some, some more people to join us. And I want to jump inside here. Oops, oh, sorry, show you. 35th place, we are, we just jumped ahead of this AVTO master, um, but we're quite a bit ahead of everybody behind us. Um, and we're kind of at this 12,500 crystal, this, this rank right here. And so we got a lot of slots to drop before we lose that ranking to be able to get that bonus. We've got a lot of ground we got to gain. We got to do really amazing to get up to the next level. Um, I don't think I don't think we'll get to the next level this season. I think we'll stay within this within the next 14 days. But uh, anyway, um, I want to show you another thing is uh, in my VMP here. Got some really amazing people working really really hard. I'm going to click that again here. Okay, now it's coming up, and I'm going to go into members, and I'm going to rank it by by points, by by victory points. So the leader, okay, our leader is the only guy that's ahead of me. I'm I'm second place. I'm doing really well. I'm just knocking it out of the park. So. Uh, I I don't know this guy, and if anybody knows this guy. Um, definitely put me in touch with him. I'm trying to, <laughs> trying to reach out through the game and everywhere I can to try to, try to get in touch with this guy. We don't have a whole lot of communication going on with our team and we need to get some more going on, but I'd love if some of you would join me in this game and then join this, uh, VMP and we can work together and earn Shiba Inu coin. You can earn Shiba Inu coin. You can earn some other coins too. But here in the United States, Shiba Inu is really the only one you can get out of this game. So I want to let you know that if you click around in here, I don't think you click on the world, but if you click on uh, oh, there's some different places you can click on. So once once you've once you've followed my referral link. To get yourself involved in this game, 
you go through the tutorial. Is it under partners? It might be under partners. You take a look here. You go to you go to where it says partners and then our partners and right here space bit. You click on this link and then um, you'll be able to get into space bit. I don't think space bit has an actual referral program. I was not able to find one. But uh, if you go if you get in this game and then click on this partner link right here, you'll be able to you'll be able to get to the register page that'll let you sign up. You won't be referred by me or anything because I don't think they have a referral program for Spacebit, but you'll be able to get all registered and start playing Spacebit. And I think you'll really enjoy being involved in this community. Um, I've been playing a uh, crypto mining game for a little over a year now, and um, I've been playing Spacebit for about a day or two, and I'm going to definitely be playing that a lot. Because it's it's just as fun, or if not funner, probably than crypto mining game. They're they're both developed by the same developers, so um, a lot of the symbols and the resources are all the same. Um, you know the the crystals and the um, you have to go into your inventory to see the other ones. But they've got uh, I guess it's not this inventory, but it's the inventory that's under workshop. And they see they so they got the the glass and the plastic and the metal and the crystal. These resources are all the same resources that are in the other game. See the exact same resource with the same symbols and everything. Now this one has the Karsik, which is actually a, a crypto coin. And this one has the um, it has a lot of coins, but the CGT is an actual uh, crypto coin that this the in-game crypto coin, and but it's got Bitcoin, Doge, Litecoin, Dash, Ethereum, Bitcoin Cash, Tron, and Shiba Inu. And Shiba Inu is the one that I'm trying to build up. You can, in the game, you can exchange everything for Shiba Inu. When I when I do my withdraws, I, I turn everything into Shiba Inu and I pull the Shiba Inu out of the game. And I can get that in my Coinbase account right now. I'm hoping that they'll go to CoinZoom or Crypto.com in the future. But they, they're working with Coinbase right now. But uh, that's the only coin here in the United States that we're able to get out of this game. So uh, that's basically just the way they've got it all set up. So I just wanted to let, let you know a little bit about, about Spacebit. Exciting new game that I recently discovered. Having a lot of fun with it. And hope you have a great day. We'll talk soon.